Hi, it's me, Cindy from Cindy's Insight, Sound Saver, and a few other channels. Um, I am right now doing a sort and shuffle, and I've already started. It's been pretty interesting so far. Um, the energy's good. It's raining here, so um, it's a really relaxing day, and I'm just looking forward to doing this reading because it's time for a new sort and shuffle. I have, um, took a little while for the pentacles to come up, but they did, so that's a good thing. Pentacles are usually uh, represented by earth signs, and earth signs are Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. And then with your fire signs, the um, elements are Leo, Sagittarius, and one other, I left my list. I'm going to do the signs um, shortly, but right now I'm just doing a, a sort and shuffle for each of the different elements. And hopefully it goes through, the last time it kind of cut me off a little bit. Um, cups are represented by Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Swords are air, which are Gemini, Aquarius, and um, Libra. Libra sometimes represents justice, Gemini, the twins, Aquarius. star card. I am randomly saying things of the um, cards that just kind of pop out at the time. It may have some kind of significance to you. I'm sure it does. I just don't know what it is. So if it resonates, wonderful. Call me. I'll read for you. <laughs> Fire signs. Travel card. When I shuffle and sort, I do them all upright. When they come out, and if they come out um, upside down, I put them right side up. It's just the way that I, um, I read my cards. It's not anything. Um, every reader does it different, so some read upside down some read right side up it's just all in what the you know spirit guides you for at that time so it's not to be discounted for those that you know that read you know they just the spirit speaks to us all different and that's the beautiful thing about reading for others cups pentacles Cups, Judgment, Wheel of Fortune, yay! Knight of Swords, okay, this is good. I like this sort and shuffle. So now we get to, I'm gonna do the signs right after this. This um, sort and shuffle is way too good not to. So right now, what we have in mind is the Wheel of Fortune. Will of Fortune is always something really fortunate. And in my brain, this is for the first week of December 2019. Um, when I, before I began this, it was in my brain to start it from December 1st through the 7th. And I apologize for having it so late. Um, but like we said, time is fluid, linear. So take what resonates, wonderful. Um, the first card we have in terms of the elements are the Knight of Swords. I'm gonna clarify these in the next video. We have the Three of Wands. We have the Knight of Pentacles. I'm loving this. We have two Knights that are showing up. And then we have the Eight of Cups, walking away from something to something else you can't see what it is that's beyond but there is something beyond and all these cups are still upright 
and your head is up high and you have your staff and the moon is guiding you. I just think it's really interesting the way the cards came up because the first one came up as fire and then I had the Wheel of Fortune. I have the Knight of Swords. Somebody trying to do something to that Wheel of Fortune. They can't though because you have the Knight of Pentacles and then walking away from something. So, if this resonates, wonderful. My next video, part two, will be um, each sign, December 1st through the 7th, Aries through Pisces. Thank you. Like, share, subscribe, view.